Hey kiddos, today we're going to do an experiment with a ramp and with some objects. Now my ramp right now is on a little bit of a slant. It goes up and then it goes lower towards the bottom. I have one, two, three, four, five, six things I'm going to test. Today we're going to test if it rolls down the ramp, if it slides down the ramp, or if it stays put. The first thing we're going to test is a car. Let's see what happens. All right, so our police car, it rolled down the ramp. Now I have a cat on the ramp. Hold on. All right, the next thing that we're going to test is a ball. Okay, so the ball rolled down. So, so far the car rolled and the ball rolled. Let's see what happens with a box. All right, so our box did not slide and it didn't roll. I wonder if you can tell me why it didn't slide or roll. Let's look at the shape. How is it different than the two things that have rolled so far? I'm gonna add a little force. That means I'm gonna push it. Let's see if it slides a little. It slides a little bit, but it doesn't go all the way down. The next thing we're gonna try is a banana. Now a banana looks kind of round, so it looks like it might roll. Let's find out. Even with force behind it, didn't really roll. And even if I push it to slide, doesn't really slide. The next thing we're gonna try is an apple. I'm gonna put the apple on its bottom first. The apple slides <laughs> by itself without any force. This time I'm gonna put it on its side. Let's see what happens. Ah, so the apple rolls and the apple slides. All right, the last thing we're gonna test is tape. I'm gonna put it on the flat side first. Okay, let's see if with a little force if it will slide. Slides a little bit. I'm gonna put it on this side this time. Take a guess before I let go if you think it's gonna roll, slide, or stay still. All right, one more thing. I'm gonna take our objects and I'm gonna increase the height, which means my ramp is gonna be steeper. So instead of being like this, it's gonna be higher like this. It's gonna be a, a steeper ramp. Okay, with our steeper ramp now, let's test each object. Take a guess before I start if you think our objects will go faster or if they're gonna go slower. First, the car. That one definitely went faster. Let's see. Next is the ball. Next is our box. Now our box stood still even with force. So let's see if it does anything now that we have a steeper ramp. Ah, oh, our box slides now. So the steeper ramp made the box slide. Next we have our banana. That one definitely went faster. Let's see. Next is the ball. Next is our box. Now our box stood still even with force. So let's see if it does anything now that we have a steeper ramp. Ah, our box slides now. So the steeper ramp made the box slide. Our banana didn't slide or roll, it stayed still. Let's see with a steeper ramp what happens. Now our banana would slide. So the steeper ramp made it slide. With our apple, it did slide down and it rolled down. Let's find out what happens with a steeper ramp. Oh, so instead of sliding, it started to roll right away because it's so steep. And finally, we have the tape. I'm gonna put it on the flat side first. Went a little faster and I'm gonna put it on the side for it to roll. All right kiddos, there you have it. Try and get a ramp for yourself at home and test to see if objects roll, if they slide, or if they stay still. 